Isn't there supposed to be a Fanto in this level? Well, that Fanto kind of just took a lunch break. Okay, part five, Desert of Demise, with a Z. Do I get a mushroom this time? It's uh, the, the quicksand. Can you run fast? Oh yeah, it's fast quicksand. So you can totally just stay under it. Uh, this is a semi-solid. Oh my god. Oh, no, that's, they do pairs. All right, I should have tried to catch the sequence. But I get another mushroom. First day back to work and you're super sleepy. I don't even need to do that to give you to be sleepy. <laughs> okay, he, there's a jump and there's, wait, the two, two, one, three, one, Anyone, anyone going to catch a pattern on this guy? Is it two, one, two, three? I guess so. Yep, great. Ah, oh, that one shoots too. Uh, oh, okay, that's the problem. The I didn't realize that the um. Uh, the, the waterfall also has the same things. So just wait for it to and then go. Now I can stand here. Pretty sure I can stand here. Just fine. No, just wait for it to and then you can always go. And then... Whatever. I'm just, I'm just boned. Like, I guess that's why you get power-ups, right? I don't know. Uh, this is some standard hack stuff. You gotta know how to play standard hacks to deal with enemy spam like this. No, I'm not that guy. Uh, two, two, one, two, three... This will be two. No, nope. what? One then three. You never see. Ah, uh, I don't know the pattern. Maybe there is no pattern. Maybe the different colored ones have different patterns. I was always saying if you see a number that's not a two, it's always followed by a two, but that time it was a one then a three. Alright. Just go under those, it doesn't matter. But this will be a two. No, it was two ones in a row. It's just, it's just chaos, honestly. We just don't know what it's going to be, so just go. Yeah, there you go. Just hold right. Done. Uh, this section is enabled with sticky hands. You can still drop items when you get a power up or take damage. So the point is we can't drop the key unless we take damage, is the idea. So it's just a just a, an SMB2 Fanto section. Right. That grey one always gets me. Wow, that one shot really far to the right. Is that normal? Bullied for reading books. This isn't like high school in the 90s. <laughs> yeah, this guy's reading a book. I don't know, man. Are we sure it was about the books? Isn't there supposed to be a Fanto in this level? Oh. Fanto kind of just took a lunch break halfway through the level. 
Part 6, Full Bloom Beetles. Oh, you know how much I love beetles. Oh. The books are for jerks. <laughs> it's pretty funny. That sounds like the sort of thing I would say. Beetle of all time. Why do we all have something against reading? I have nothing against reading. I'm just telling you, I do not read. I do not read books. And that's not a positive thing. <clears throat> it's not a, a, a great quality to have. like real a real bunch of fun thanks for under no worries quirkiest books um out of curiosity what kind of books do you like to read do you have any particular you know styles i'm i'm not i don't know about books do they have genres do books have genres and stuff have you got a favorite um uh, you know whatever the equivalent of a director is for books <laughs> We got one of those. <laughs> All right. New beetle section. This okay. This one goes up. That was a really good uppipe. That was my favourite uppipe to do in Super Mario World so far. Uh huh. Oh, what does that one do? I didn't know there was actually a book called Jurassic Park. I thought it was The Lost World, the Michael Crichton book that Jurassic Park was based on. <laughs> Just stay on that. What is, okay, this one just falls. Turns out that movies get released. Uh, there's a home release for popular movies, and so you can uh, you can watch it later after it's had its run at the cinema by purchasing a VHS tape. Ah, uh, remember tapes? <laughs> They're back. It's probably hard to design vertical sections for maximum satisfaction for first reads. I am not up for that challenge. In a door. So he gets to take a shortcut through the Mario solid blocks. Okay, and then he hits the wall. I get, hey, let's learn a sequence. Go, go to jump that. Woo, come on. It's party time with Hooded Edge. Oh, you can totally bounce on it. All right. Okay, so it doesn't push you. Woo, come on. It's party time. Get up and party. I don't know if there's a good way to do this. Do I want this to catch up to me? Am I trying to lead it out? Let's say we are. Doesn't look like it. All right, well, I gotta beat it. 
Oh, it can go through one tile gaps. Oh my, okay. Beat it down, but not by too much because we need it here. Stop hitting the... Uh, I really wish it wouldn't keep shaking the screen and just like blasting straight off the walls like that, or whatever that is. It's so awkward to ride this thing, it's, it's not like anything else. It's just what you gotta deal with when there's custom things. Okay, where are you? Dude, it's not even hitting a wall, look at that. That, that's apparently hitting a wall. What is that that's hitting? Up. Okay, we've got a net. Net. Oreo's Abodum. Make sure to clear each sprite from these individual rooms and survive the journey up. Okay. Uh, clear the sprites. Sorry. One second. So I just uh, hit there. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> that was exactly what you do. can't keep the shell. That's kind of the, the idea. Oh, really good. All right. I mean, that's what you do. You just got to like actually survive swimming in that tiny gap. Totally possible to do. Whoops. All right. That's all the sprites. Now, what do we got here? What do the nets do? They make... I can climb on the nets. <sighs> so... We have to end with the urchin. Looks like we got a... I don't see a use for the blue... For the internal... Like the coupling thing. I think you gotta kill this guy. Oh my god. And then like re-grab the shell somehow. Hopefully, this, uh, these two neutralize each other. In fact, they do. We learned that in the previous room. Right. Uh, more shells. We've got to kick this one. All right. Oops. Bye-bye, shell. That's, I mean, that's... You can see that's the idea. Pretty much, right? So we'll just kick it to the right. Shell. And then we gotta take it through and neutralize it. There we go. What now? Can I kill these guys? But you can. Never seen these used underwater, personally. So we're just gonna be very careful here, huh? How do I? I downloaded it today, but it still says 1.0 in the, like, the file name. But, you know, sometimes people do stealth updates. So, 
No, this, this all this makes sense. So, release that thing so that goes away. I'm gonna spin this and then take damage, right? Unless there's more sprites that I that I missed. Oh my god! Yep, that's what you do, I think. this clutch man I, I just don't know the hitboxes in this game still I swear I um I swear that would have worked first try but that's fine right. fast yep That's totally a pipe there, right? I saw it, it closed down into a two tile opening. Seven. I'll write that down for later. I'm sure it will be important. Always be on the lookout for secrets. trusting those coins now. We're developing trust in coins and I don't know if I like it. There we go. It's a water scroller, that's right. Bumpty! 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 <laughs> Alright. Tofugawa Tundra is part 8. This is the Topugawa something. It's got bumpties. And the red blocks are bad, as you might have imagined. Yeah, you can't slide kill them. Just in case you're wondering. Thought I'd give that a try. Just in case you were curious. Is this ice physics? I guess it would be, right? It totally is ice physics. That was not a good time to test out whether or not there's ice physics. Can we get a redo? Uh, some of the early levels had some real tight spaces and some, some fiddly platforming that wasn't my favourite thing. But, you know, we'll work it out. Huh. Yeah, it's neutral. Okay. Is Hark 1 labelled as beginner? <laughs> damn, if that's the case, then, <laughs> then damn. Okay, he does fall down. a small jump. Is that guy, that guy's not coming back. Alright, that's fine. One tile man. Alright, so this guy's stuck. We need to, we need him and stuff. I don't know how that setup was meant to work. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. I just don't understand the penguins. I don't know. I don't know what any of this is. But this seems good. 
We'll jump over the guy. Shigeru loves penguins. Yeah, I mean, I guess so, right? There are penguins in some games. Some Mario games have penguins, that's true. Yeah. You kind of get funneled into that one. I'm not sure how I would go about dodging that. Kind of maxing out your jump to get to there. Maybe I just gotta scroll the camera differently. Uh huh. Well, hey, let's play the waiting game. Uh, well, no, this one, see, this one goes back and forth. I like this one. To the slope. Yeah. Sorry, that looks like a really big jump. Oh, no, there's a piranha plant. Okay. Phew. Yep. Yeah. <sighs> All right. Goal. 